let's implement linear regression or univariate regression using sklr luckily we don't have to implement the cost function or gradient descent by ourselves the sklr library will help us do everything by itself we just need to call out our linear regression model and fit our model into our data let's look into an ecosystem of that and then let's start implement it in jupyter notebook the first phase of it is train test split we have already seen this in feature engineering or mostly in the terminologies part what we do is we take our data set and break it out in a train test split that is in the ratio of 1 is to 3 over here we have so we have this data set let's have a quick look into this we have this data set this might be our training set okay so this might be our training set and this will be our test set so if it is of size 100 uh, 80 will be for training and 20 will be for test we will train our model from 80 points that is from 80 points we will get the straight line and from the rest 20 points we will just uh, compare our model how good our model is and how good it is able to predict results out so that is how we do train test split we can always set out the size over here it's 1, point, uh, 1 by 3 you can also mention 0 0.5 if you want to uh, have a 50-50 uh, ratio uh, splitting the data set now the next part and the most important part is fitting the regression on the training set the second step is, is to fit our model to the training set. To do so, we will be importing the linear regression model. So we start from this line. We import from sklearn.linear model import linear regression. After importing the class, we are going to create an object of that class. So in the next line, we will just create an object of that class. So here's the code for that. In this code, we have also used a fit method to fit our simple linear regression object to the training set. In the fit function, we have passed our x train and y train, which is our training data, data set for the dependent and independent variable. We have fitted our regression object to the training set so that the model can easily learn the correlation between the predictor and target variable. So after we have called out the linear regression, we are creating an object of that class and we are just fitting our data of that. After that, the final steps that we are needed to do is get out predictions from it. What fit does it? It just fits our model from our training data. So no need to think about cost function or gradient descent. Just calling out regression.fit will help us do that. Last step is just prediction. We use the predict method. We will be using the predict method. If you want to predict uh, predict for x test, whatever data we have for x test, we can just write regressor dot predict x test, and for training data, we can just pass out x train. That's it for using the sklearn library for linear regression. We follow the same steps for each and every other algorithm. So this is the first and last time we are going to have actually a theoretical aspect of implementing it. Let's jump into Jupyter Notebook and look into our problem statement and implement everything, whatever we have learned. 